here is what we would like people to know about knitters if we could actually talk to them. Uh, knitters are smart. Knitters are very smart. If you meet a knitter, you can assume a basic level of intelligence. You know they can read. You know they can count more or less. <laughs> Uh, and since you aren't ain't free, you know that they are smart enough to earn an income or to trick someone else out of theirs. <laughs> I actually believe that knitters are among some of the smartest people walking the earth. I believe that knitters knit mostly because they are so intelligent that the world as it exists in its natural form is not enough for them. <laughs> they cannot just sit. They cannot just watch TV. They cannot just listen to that guy. <laughs> Insert whatever guy you want there. <laughs> we want you to know that knitters are not really patient and that you should remove their knitting at your peril. <laughs> we want you to know that knitters are generous. We've spoken about this before. It's partly because of um, the way knitting changes your brain a little bit, the cumulative action, all that stuff. It's also because knitters have, along with artificially generated patience, artificially generated generosity. We can talk openly about it here. It's just us. We all know the truth. Knitters give this much stuff away because it does not fit. <laughs> Gage actually worked. <laughs> but mostly we want them to know that when we're knitting, we're doing way more than it looks like we're doing. I've been trying to convince people of this for some time, and I finally decided to go and get myself a little 